Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel, Chiboy Cosmic, and in this video, we'll be testing out both level 80 Moon Knight and level 80 Iron Man side by side in World Boss Legend and in ABX, both of them in the same video, and see which one of these characters perform much better in each of these game modes because World Boss and ABX are like probably the most played game modes in this game. Probably. But yeah, we'll be testing out both of them in both of these game modes. So, let's get to the details page for both Iron Man and Moon Knight. Starting off with Iron Man. Uh, let's go to the details page with Iron Man. I have 50,000 energy attack, max attack speed, critical rate, critical damage, ignore defense, cooldown, and dodge rates. Alright. For the Urus, I have about one. A mythic energy attack Uru and I have about seven uh, legendary energy attack Urus one uh, critical no two critical rate uh, legendary Urus on Iron Man the rest of the Urus are completely irrelevant the attack speed and ignore defense are all irrelevant those are Urus that I had before I, while I was crafting my cards so I didn't change any of that uh, the skills are all at level 6 all of them alright uh, except for the fifth skill, it's at level 10. Uh, the type enhancement then maxed out, level, uh, rank 6. The ISO 8 is stage 6 power for Angry Hulk, no artifact, and I have a mighty CTP of destruction on him with a strike effect of 100% damage increase to boss types. Also, the uniform is at mythic. Alright, now let's get into. Moon Knight. For Moon Knight, the details page, I have about 33,000 uh, physical attack, max attack speed, critical damage, ignore defense, and skill cooldown with 60% critical rate. I don't have to worry about a critical rate, uh, about it being 60% because Iron Man, uh, not Iron Man, excuse me, Moon Knight already gives himself a 15% critical rate increase from his fifth skill. So it is definitely the soft cap right here. Uh, for the Urus, I have about two four six eight uh legendary physical attack urus and i have about five uh legendary critical rate urus for the skills are all level six all of them are level six except for the first skill is at level one the type enhancement is at rank four the iso 8 set is at stage six overdrive no artifacts ctp of energy and the uniform is at normal let's get into the cards real quick for the cards i have about 81 percent all attack increase with three percent physical attack and 39 percent energy attack with a 20 percent energy attack proc so iron man has advantages in energy attack over moon knight but that doesn't mean much because in the testing we will see the results differently from each other so I do have a low physical attack, but that doesn't matter. I'm gonna have to fix that uh, later, later on my cars. I'm gonna have to fix those cars a little bit, increase a little bit my physical attack so I can match out and balance it uh, between it and the energy attack. But yeah, I have a little bit more energy attack, more so than the physical attack. So, with that being said, all right, let's get into the testing in World Boss Legend and then we will get to the testing in ABX and see which one of these characters dominates in each of these game modes.
That I can't, that I won't, that I fail, that I'll never make it out, yeah Please tell me all the bad, never good Fill my head full of every single doubt, yeah Please say any negative thoughts I pop off when I hear people say I cannot I get off to the thought of proving everyone wrong I won't stop to the top, so you better back off and get lost I'ma stay loud, stay proud Never running out, never heading south I'll be spreading out, call it word of mouth Can't put me down, I'll be getting loud You can never douse, not what I'm about Have your fucking cloud, it be raining now I keep making sound, go another round Bitch, I'm legend bound, can't stop me now You don't wanna fuck with me a slow burn like a disease Just tell me that I can and I'll show you things that you couldn't believe Just tell me that I can 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 Cause I just wanna hear it out your mouth, yeah Give me fuel, it's a tool that I use To go ahead and run my fucking mouth, yeah I take shots, I take loss, I make shots, I miss lots I tell you get big box, you get yachts You swing lots and pop off a big shot I ain't done chasing, got big dreams, bigger things, impatient Who's at the top, think they need replacement Who's at the top, think I'm gonna erase that face it I don't give up quick, I don't give up shit I won't give up this Cause I know that I want it, know that I'm on it I'll make it, I promise You don't wanna fuck with me a slow burn like a disease Just tell me that I can and I'll show you things That you couldn't believe Just tell me that I can
I'm one of a kind, there ain't no one like me. So I define it's the real damn thing. Don't be wasting any time, I got somewhere to be. Always on the grind, yeah, you know me. All the crown will be mine, you can call me king. A matter of time for you all love me. Finally at my prime, right where I wanna be. I'm one of a kind, there ain't no one like me. Put my money where my mouth is, I'ma get it now, kid. Heard around town, this sound is astounding. Feel my heart pounding, bass is surrounding. Think I finally found it, so I'm gonna mount it. Like an ex-girlfriend, I'ma get it back. Make a couple wrecks as I make a couple tracks. Stay on the attack as I'm writing every rap in a snapback. Black talk is coaching his jack. Man, I feel good, dog. I feel good. Woke up a little richer, also with a little wood. If I could teach this shit, man, really wish I could. So listen up closely, I'll give you a push. I raise hell every time my lyrics pop up. I take shots at the haters with a sawed off. Girl, you better keep me up or I'll nod off. One shot, all I got, I will not stop. I'm one yeah. of a kind, there ain't no one like me. So I define it's the real damn thing. Don't be wasting any time, I got somewhere to be. Always on the grind, yeah, you know me. Hold the crown will be mine, you can call me king. A matter of time for you all love me. Find me at my prime, right where I wanna be. I'm one of a kind, there ain't no one like me. Yeah. It's not yeah. enough, man, I want more. Right. I keep on doing business, open every single door. Yeah. I wanna be the richest, so you see me up on four. I can do this through my music, that's how I even the score I don't take it slow, man, I want it bad Every single day, I be carving out a path Like a girl with a tat on her back, all black I'ma take her right back to my pad where it's at I don't ever slack off, so you better back off I'm about to blast off, that's to the NASA Everybody stand up, put your fucking hands up That's the demand, yeah. welcome to the brand, bro I know I'm not cautious, I take risks And no, you can't stop this, I'm too slick She knows that she wants it so come quick, baby, know that I'm on it I don't quit I'm one yeah. of a kind, there ain't no one like me So I define it's the real damn thing Don't be wasting any time, I got somewhere to be Always on the grind, yeah, you know me Hold the crown will be mine, you can call me king A matter of time for you all love me Finally at my prime, right where I wanna be I'm one of a kind, there ain't no one like me I'm one of a kind, there ain't no one like me All right, so we got it clear right now that uh, my Moon Knight did not perform so well in Stage 9, World Boss Legend Ultron uh, against Iron Man. Iron Man finished that stage in like a minute. In a minute, he finished that stage, or less than a minute. However, for Moon Knight, he took two minutes to get him all the way to five bars, and I got caught, and he died. But even if I didn't die, I wouldn't have outpaced Iron Man either way. Even if I didn't die with Moon Knight, I wouldn't have managed to outperform Iron Man anyways, regarding that situation. However, even though Iron Man was performing so much well that Moon Knight uh, against World Boss Legend Ultra on Stage 9, Moon Knight completely demolished Iron Man in ABX. Iron Man made it to 7.8 million, let's just say 8 million for the sake of the argument. Let's just say 8 million points in ABX. Uh, Moon Knight made it to 9.1 million in ABX with the same team up, the same leadership and support. No, no difference between any of those. Uh, yeah, I think Moon Knight is Personally, this is just my personal opinion. I don't know about if other content creators have any doubts about it. But in my personal opinion, I think Moon Knight is designed specifically for ABX. Specifically, even though he doesn't have the silence effect season, I feel like he's like he's he's just made for ABX only, specifically for ABX. Uh, that's what I think it is. Um, and even in ABX, I think I missed a rotation with the Awakened skill. I think I did uh, in my run, which means I could have scored even more higher. But yeah, I believe that Iron Man was made specifically for World Boss Legend and Dormammu. Because Iron Man and Dormammu is so good. He's actually super good. Whereas for Moon Knight, I feel like he's made for specifically ABX or Squad Battle one of these two game modes because ABX and Squad Battle are kind of similar in a way 
but yeah, when, when there's have to you have to fight uh, the boss and the small mobs around him. Yeah, I, I, I do believe that Moon Knight with this new uniform, he's performing so much better right now in AVX and Squad Battle. And I do believe that with a maxed build on Moon Knight, I could probably hit 11 million, maybe 11.5 or 12 million nearby that. I know I'm exaggerating a little bit, but I can't stop thinking about it. That if I manage to get him to tier 4, alright? Because this skill effect, by the way, it refreshes every second. Alright, the, 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 the skill effect lasts very long for about 10 seconds. But it refreshes every one second for 10 seconds, if that makes sense. So yeah, I think uh, Moon Knight is designed specifically for ABX. Specifically for ABX. That's what I think it is. Uh, yeah, and I'm really impressed with the performance that he made. Like, I have a regular CTP of energy and Iron Man has a mighty ctb of destruction with the with the strike effect and the uniform is at mythic whereas moon knight's uniform is at normal and moon Knight still outperformed iron man in avx so you see what i mean if you guys paid attention at the beginning of the video i said i have more energy attack on my cards than physical attack but that wouldn't matter because the testing would show us otherwise and that's what i meant it is um Muna definitely outperformed Iron Man in ABS and I believe that's due to the fact that he can easily um, cancel through his skills and the animation will still continue anyways whereas for Iron Man it's kind of complicated you, you will have to cancel the skills and you either want to proc on the fifth skill or on the third skill I personally just proc on the third skill because it lasts very long, all right? The animation will last very, very long, and it hits really, really hard, and kind of gives that chain hit damage within it. So that's why I go with the third skill instead of the fifth skill. I know, I know, there's a lot, there's players over there in ABX that go preferably with the fifth skill because it has an iframe and the frost beast will not attack you, but the animation doesn't last very long with the fifth skill. That's why I go with the third skill only if you get what I mean but yeah uh, either ways I don't think proccing on the fifth skill is gonna make a difference either uh, yeah I do believe that ABX is just made for Moon Knight's uniform like uh, I'm sorry I, I believe that Moon Knight's uniform is made specifically for ABX and squad battle game modes whereas uh, Iron Man's uniform is made for world boss and Durmamu uh, uh, whatchamacallit uh, game modes so yeah I'm really impressed with this performance. Each of them is good in their own way. There's, I personally, there's no difference between level 80 Moon Knight and level 80 Iron Man. It's just both of them are good in their own ways. If that makes sense. They're both good in their own way. So, personally, I would go to upgrade... If I, was, if I were to choose which one to go with... I would probably say go for Iron Man. I would probably say go for Iron Man. The reason for that is because World Boss Legend and Rumamu GBR uh, are much more valuable game modes than ABX. Right? Unless you're a big ABX player, that's fine. You can go with Moon Knight's uniform. But personally i feel like world boss legend and the mamu game mode the round gbr are much more valuable than avx which is why i would prefer people would go for iron man back to basics uniform and tier for him as soon as possible i'm still stuck at this shit with this goddamn soul of the Faltine. it is kind of hard to farm it a little bit sometimes but yeah uh, both are good both Iron Man uh, level 80 back to basics and Moon Knight from the Disney Plus show uh, level 80 uniform are both good in their own ways. They're both good, they're both great. Moon Knight is made for ABX and squad battle, and you got uh, Iron Man made for World Boss Legend and uh, what you call it, uh, Doom Mamu. Yeah. So 
really impressed with this performance and I really enjoyed doing this testing between these two characters because these are the only level 80 characters that we have today and I'm currently and I'm pretty sure in the next update in the Thor Love and Thunder Thor is gonna get a level 80 tier 4 which is pretty exciting because Thor was literally my first tier 4 character in my <laughs> tier 4 who wish I wish he was my first tier 3 character in this game and I'm really excited about this uh, upcoming update for the Thor Love and Thunder. And also I'll be making a testing video uh, about Thor's uniform uh, and see how well he is currently compared to the metas and if he's still keeping up or not. And hopefully the, the upcoming uniform that Thor will get will be much better, but yeah. Moon Knight and Iron Man testing was a fantastic video to make, I had so much fun doing it and we're gonna wrap it up right here guys, thank you guys so much for watching, if you guys enjoyed this video hit the like button, subscribe and share so you will help the channel grow and hit the notification ring bell so you won't miss out on any of the upcoming videos that I'll be posting, yes I know I still haven't done any testing with Elektra, I'm still falling a little bit short on Elektra, I'm really really close to tier 3 her. I only need 200 Essence of Dimension and she's good to go. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, hit the like button, subscribe and share to help the channel grow. And hit the notification ring bell so you don't miss out on any of the upcoming videos I'll be posting on this channel. And join my Discord server. Uh, the link is in the description box below. Uh, if you want to discuss with me about uniforms, character, rotation, builds. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Take care. Peace.